It is critical to contain the spread. We could be staring at a global health emergency here. There is no cure available. Medical experts are tackling the unknown here. But the first signs of the outbreak can be traced back to mid-December, more than a month ago. Officials at the local level tried to hide, even cover up the extent of the crisis. Beijing was slow to act and it ended up mishandling the outbreak. At first, China denied it all. But now we could be staring at a pandemic. China failed to contain the outbreak. This was much before the outbreak began. Several reports confirming this have emerged. Some of them are on your screens. These doctors had noticed rapid disruptions in respiratory systems of their patients. Healthcare workers were infected in early January. This is clear evidence that the coronavirus existed well before China admitted. Biggest headline that emerged today, the coronavirus could infect 60% of the global population. 60%, that's an awfully big number. The coronavirus could have originated in a lab, but no medical experts have confirmed this theory yet. Let me repeat that. They say that there is no tangible evidence to back the argument. This is what the Chinese ambassador to South Africa said earlier this month, and I'm quoting, although the epidemic first broke out in China, it did not necessarily mean that the virus originated from China, let alone made in China. What does this even mean? It is a made in China pandemic, and that is a fact. One, China ignored reports of the virus for weeks when it was first reported. Two, China targeted the whistleblowers. Three, China destroyed test samples of patients. And four, China lied to the world about how serious the situation is. You just saw, for more than two months now, Vion has been bringing you extensive coverage on the Wuhan coronavirus. We were the first to tell you about the outbreak. We were the first Indian network to report from the epicenter, that is Wuhan. And we were the first to expose the cover-up by the Chinese state. As the Wuhan virus now spreads in India, India's parliamentarians are waking up to the threat. Today, the outbreak was discussed in Parliament. Congress MP Manish Tiwari posed this question to Health Minister of India, Dr. Harshvardhan. There are a number of uh, theories which are doing the rounds with regard to the origin of coronavirus. All aware that the World Health Organization is not being given access to Wuhan in order to investigate the origins of the coronavirus. Would the government of India uh, talk to the World Health Organization, talk to other friendly nations in order to ensure that the origin of coronavirus is investigated thoroughly. Sir, let me inform the House that, uh, number one, we are in regular contact with the World Health Organization, the regional director of WHO for the Southeast Asia region, and also with the director general of WHO in Geneva. And I, uh, as per uh, uh, our information, I don't think there is any need for any apprehension about the uh, UK su su suspect type of, uh, you see, there are a lot of uh, things roaming around, uh, 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 passing in WhatsApp and all. There is, uh, at the moment, as per our conversations with WHO, there is no, you can say, authenticity in them, neither any substance in all those reports. So we should be assured that whatever we are doing, we are, you see, we are focusing on our country right now. And whatever research is needed, which is being done all over the world, we are also in ICMR uh, proceeding with all those research activities. We are in touch with all the scientists all over the world. So, uh, and uh, regarding these reports about the origin, that is being investigated. It is a pertinent question that the government should focus on once the firefight is over. For anyone who's looking for answers to this question and others, including the government of India, we recommend our ground reports and investigations. We started tracking this outbreak in December. In January, we had featured a series of reports on how the Wuhan virus was spreading in China, how whistleblowers were punished for speaking out, how the state tried to hide the pandemic. Vion has documented all aspects of the coronavirus story. We reported the facts. He spoke to experts and busted conspiracy theories. The Wuhan coronavirus outbreak in India is a public health emergency now. And in national interest, we will share our reportage with the government of India.
because at a time like this, accurate information is your biggest asset and your best bet to fight. The world is already paying a heavy price for China's attempts to hide the truth. India must pay heed to the evidence that proves China's criminal negligence.